Hi everyone, this is Raju Mahathu. My last few videos on Table View API, we have seen about how can we display data in a table with a row manner. So we have seen displaying rows in a table without any section and also we have seen how can we display rows with different section like we can display different different rows for different different categories and also we have discussed about the how can we get the number of rows present in a table which has no section so today we will see how can we get the number of section that are present in a table which represent different different rows so to make this let's add a alloy tag here in our view section view module so let's add it now let's add the window tag which will hold our all UI elements I am going to adding background color which is generally white in color so then I am adding the table view which will hold all the data now to show display rows in a different section we need to define the different section header so that is table view section where we need to define the header section header so header title so that might be like section 1 and let's add few rows here for this section 1 So table I have added three rows here. So let's add few more section so that we can get the number of section here. How many section we have displayed on the table? So let's rename the title. This section two, section three. Now let's run it first so that we can view the num row data with a different section now it's running it's compiling actually so here it comes now here you can see that I have added three different section with the different rows under these sections so on my one of my video we have seen the number of rows that are present on the table so now I will check how can we get the number of sections from a table so to do that let's add a click event on a table so that on click of any of the rows on the table we can get the number of section present on the same table so let's add ID for the table so that we can catch that table on its controller. Let's name it as table table and add click event. Let's make rename sorry, let's name it as a show section count. save it now let's define this function with the controller representing this view that is in just dot js let's add the function here now to get the section count let's add a variable which will hold that data like section count now I will call that catch that table with the table ID now this is the data present on the table and the length so here it is 
now let's display it on the alert message so let's add a label here total section section count now let's save it and let's see it on the simulator so that we can confirm that it's working fine now it's loading so on the next video i will show how can we get the number of total number of rows that are present in different section so here it's loading so here you can see that this is a table with different section now i hope on click of any of the rows we can see the number of section present on the table sorry oh sorry i have typed the table name wrong here so here you can see that if anything goes wrong we can see on the simulator while running the application so that we can confirm that everything goes fine while we checking with device actual device so let's run it again okay it's running so here on click of let's click on the any of the row here you can see that the total number of rows are displaying here as you have added the th num three sections so here it counts display three so up to this for today thanks